Hello everyone watching on YouTube and welcome back to Tales of Symphonia Remastered. Coming up on 20 hours in the game already, time flies. Symphonia? Good game, good game. We're at Mizaho, right. I also need to look at, to remind myself, because it's been a couple of days, because I have way too many playthroughs happening at once. We got Thunderblade. Stone Blast needs more usage. We gotta get that up to 50. That 18 is, that's a rookie number right there. Those are rookie numbers. Air Thrust is the upgraded one. Fireball, only a few more fireballs, not bad. We got Healing Wind last time, very useful. So, Zelos is doing well. And we've got, like, the waifu squad going, I guess. Let's get it. Ah, uh, yes. The mystical village Mizuho. Very Japanese. Sheena, what is the meaning of this? How could you bring outsiders into the village? I am prepared to accept my punishment. Inform the Vice Chief. I've brought the travelers from Silverant. From Silverant? You are from the dying world of Silverant? Well, except for me. I see. Sheena, come with me. The rest of you, wait in front of the Chief's house. Oh, I guess Regal's okay now. <sighs> oh, he's awake. Wh where am I? You're our prisoner. Don't try anything funny. This dude's always been a prisoner. Do you see how his hands are still shackled? I like to think that I'm smart enough not to start trouble when I don't understand the situation. Dude, it's gonna be so wild hearing Itachi Uchiha's voice throughout this game. I completely forgot that Regal had the same voice actor. Oh, I'm in control now. Hi, do you have something for me? I can't believe she's brought outsiders into Mizuho. Sheena is always bringing danger to this village. Do you have something for me? Yeah. The weather is so nice today. Thanks for the $900. Chosen one in the Igiguri style, even love must be conducted in secret. I don't think I'm cut out to be a citizen of Mizuho. Yeah. Yeah, probably not, Zelos. Probably not. So wait, I need to go to the chief's house now, which is... Hey, is this Orochi? The vice chief is ready to see you. W why is this voice acted? Travelers from Silverant, you may enter. Thank you. Our leader, Chief Igaguri, is ill. I, the Vice Chief Taiga, shall speak on his behalf. Because Sheena failed to kill you, we, the people of Mizuho, now face persecution from the Tetheala royal family and the Church of Martel. It seems like you can fix that by just killing them all right now. You've got an entire, like, village of ninja, right? Is that true? Yes. At least from what I've heard. Now I have a question. People of Silverant, what do you plan to do in Tetheala, the land of your enemies? I've been thinking about that for a long time. Someone asked me why I came all the way to Tetheala, what it is that I want to do. I want a world where everyone can have a normal life. I'm tired of people having to become sacrifices. I'm tired of discrimination. I'm tired of people becoming victims. Yeah, we'll just fix all of that in one, like, 40-hour game. No problem. Deku, welcome to stream. How's it going, man? I'm tired of it all. You are an idealist. The worlds of Tetheala and Silverant flourish only by victimizing the other. So long as that structure remains the same, anything you say is mere sophistry. Sophistry? Is that... Is that a word that's, like, coined from, like, Sophocles to mean, like, you're just speaking philosophically? And not in actuality? That's my immediate guess. Based on the context. But I don't ever remember hearing this word in my life. Then we need to change that structure. This world was made by that Yggdrasil guy, right? How would he know? 
If a human or elf built this, then we should be able to change it as well. <laughs> you speak like the hero, Mythos. He was a sublime idealist. He ended the ancient war by insisting there was a way for the two warring countries to coexist in peace. Are you saying you can become the next Mythos? I'm not Mythos. I want to save the two worlds my way with the help of my friends. Yeah, dude, the power of anime friendship. I see. In other words, you aren't worried about following past methods. Well then, we shall search for a new path as well. Vice Chief, do you mean... Yes, we will use our information network to aid you. In return, when the path of prosperity for both worlds has been found, we wish to move our people to Silveron. Yeah, I guess we can just, like, do that. Seems super easy, barely an inconvenience. But I don't have any right to decide something like that. D is there anyone in- is there, like, any kind of central government in Silveron that could say, like, no? Do you have to ask permission? Silveron seems like it was just, like, each individual city was governed by its own dude. No kind of, like, central government for any of the continents. So, I mean, like... Who's gonna stop you from just plopping Mizuho down at one of the unclaimed territories and being like, hey, we live here now? All we need is for you to aid us in our move. Is everyone okay with us joining forces with the people of Mizuho? If it will change the relationship of the two worlds. Well, it doesn't sound like a bad deal. Let's hurry up and decide so we can go rescue Persea. As long as Tetheala is safe. I don't care what you guys do. Okay then, it's settled. We're going to look for a way to change the two worlds. Let's work together. Agreed. Then I hereby order Sheena to continue to accompany you. This time, however, not just as an observer, but as a representative. Make us proud. Yes, sir. But Taiga, you sure you want to turn the royals and the church against you like that? How about if I ask you? Given a choice between the forces which wish to sacrifice one of the worlds, and the force that wishes to preserve both worlds, which would you side with? I'd like to say the one that's likely to win, but I suppose I'd want to help the side that wants to preserve both worlds. Zello's keeping it real. I respect it. Exactly. Now the first thing we shall do is devote all our resources to locating the Riards. Fortunately, it appears that Sheena attached a guardian to the Riards. That's really convenient. So we should be able to locate them shortly. Through some kind of magic, I assume? Understood. Thank you for your help. Is he for real? Gentle Idealist, okay. We take those. What's your name? Regal. Regal, huh? I'm sorry, but we're gonna have to keep you prisoner for a bit longer. Lloyd, how about letting Pops here fight too? Pops? Look at how shredded Regal is. Look at his hair. How can you call him Pops? Even though he might betray us? He has business with Persea, right? What's a little betrayal between friends? And he's not going to try anything before he gets a chance to speak with her, you know? Actually, that's not a bad idea. Rain? I don't know about this, but I won't make a fuss. I also started off as your enemy. Yeah, anime does that a lot. It's fun. Well, will you fight alongside us for now? All right. I swear upon my good name and these shackles that bind me. I shall not betray you. We didn't even ask for you to swear on anything. We just wanted you to, like, help us punch stuff. If you do anything, even the slightest bit suspicious, I'll burn you to a crisp. Got it? Gina, shut up. Well then, welcome to our group, Regal. I believe this is the full party, if I'm not mistaken. This is the whole crew. I guess you could also include Kratos, and he's not here, but you never have Kratos and Zelos in the team at the same time in this game, if I'm not mistaken. What genus? Why? 
Absolutely not. Uh, let's put in Regal because he's new, and then I like Sheena, so we're gonna put in Sheena in place of Prisea because Rain is our main healer. I need to find a compound fusion skill between Zelos and Sheena, assuming they even have one. Surely, I imagine every character has at least one, right? You would think. We need to make that happen. Mizuho's Information Network. I hope they can find the Riards. Mizuho's Intelligence Network is nothing to sneeze at. They'll find them for sure. Yeah, I've heard some incredible stuff about the Mizuho Intelligence Network. Supposedly, they know the location of all the treasures in Tethiala. You bet. When we really want to, there's nothing we can't find out. How useful. Sounds like a great thing to have on our side. Ah, I wonder if they could research the measurements of all the girls in Tethiala for me. Oh, Zelos. You stupid chosen. Oh, well. You know, you get what you deserve. Yo, Tofu, thank you. I love Tofu. From this point on, we shall work hard as your allies. All right, so the village has already been informed. That's nice. Is there like an inn somewhere? I could use some health. We mustn't, we mustn't. What? No, that's not right. Next you say it's fine, it's fine. No, oh, okay. <laughs> that, that was a conversation that happened. I need a heal is like all I want right now. Small knight. Your name is Persea, correct? About your family. Yep. Hey, get away from her. I apologize. So you're her little knight. Don't make fun of me. I've got magic, you hear me? Genus. B what is it? Don't worry, I'll protect you. Genus, could you be any more obvious? He bears no hostility. There is no need for combat. Ah. Oh. Also, I have no need for your protection. Oh. Alright, get absolutely shot down. Welcome to the variety shop. Yeah, okay. Um, is there any, like, cool customization I could do? The Aqua brand is what I currently have. I know that this says it's more stats. I don't have an Earth Dagger anyway, but I like swords over daggers on Zelos and Kratos. I could make this for Colette, but we're not really using Colette, so would it really serve much purpose? These are both better for Lloyd. I think he's currently using the Osafune, and if he is, then we could craft that. I'm not playing as Lloyd right now. He is. But there will be points in the game later where we don't have Zelos as a party member, and so I'll have to play as Lloyd instead. So with that in mind, we should still look at upgrading stuff for Lloyd. Also, those swords look way cooler. Way cooler. Isn't there a title for Zelos you get for talking to a lot of the women in the game or something? Probably, I don't remember. I didn't pay much attention to titles, I feel like, when I originally played this game. Speaking of titles, Lloyd got a new one. HP and strength down for more TP, defense, and intelligence. No, I'd, I'd rather you focus more on strength than HP, to be honest. Hit hard and take as many hits as you can with your HP stat. I really just, I, I, I need a heal before I go anywhere or do anything. Hi, Taiga, you got a bed I can use? If we hear anything else that may be useful to you, we will let you know. All right, cool, yeah, um. I, I like, I need health, is what I need. You only really gun for titles if you're plat hunting? I, I, I might platinum hunt in my uh, spare time after I finish this. Tales of games, especially older ones, because I think I got the I got the Arise Platinum on stream, I believe, in my first playthrough. But Tales, uh, the older Tales games, like getting plats on them, usually require multiple playthroughs. So if I get the Platinum Trophy, it'll be on my own time, probably using a definitely using a guide for it. Reasons for the shackles. Say, Regal, why do you keep those handcuffs on? I'm more dangerous without the handcuffs. These are the symbol of my crime. A crime symbolized by handcuffs? 
I know, you're a handcuff thief. I, Lloyd. Oh, that's not it? Huh, then you ran around causing trouble by putting handcuffs on people? Lloyd. I, like, dude, please. I'm sorry. I suppose I should have said it in a way that was easier to understand. Yeah, you should have said it like you were talking to an eight-year-old, because that's basically Lloyd's mental capacity level. Cat's exploration. Yeah, I don't care about, like, the cat's exploration. I don't even know what that does. I really, like, there are only two buildings. I, there's nowhere for me to get a heal? Mizaho, the mystical village. What was that? Celos was lying to us the whole time. It was a little unusual, but still just a regular village. I was super excited about it and wound up being so disappointed. Yeah, I wanted to see the flying carp. Flying carp. Yeah, I wanted to see those flowers that bloom when you sprinkle ash on them. What are you talking about? Me, I wanted to visit that underwater castle that you ride a turtle to. What? Are you guys describing Studio Ghibli films? That stupid Chosen. What kind of stories has he been feeding them? <laughs> the title, Idiot Chosen. <laughs> okay, I, I love the idea that Zelos was just feeding them lies like mystical, like, yeah, dude, they have like a, a river made of chocolate or just random nonsense and they all believed him. Like, that, that does sound very funny. No, I don't, strength up is nice, but I don't want the intelligence down. Honestly, actually, I didn't realize I had this loudmouth one. It sucks to lose some of the defense on level ups, but I want the intelligence and accuracy up by going with loudmouth because we're mostly using Zelos as a magic swordsman right now. I'm mostly throwing down magic, so. Hi. It seems the pursuers have left the forest. You should hurry. All right, let's head for Altessa's place right away. I want to go home to my village. All right, I was at first then. Yes, Perseus' parents are probably worried about her. We should head to Ozette. Yo, but hear me out. Is there anywhere in Mizaho that I can get a heal? Asking for a friend. I'm willing to pay money. Guess what? Guess what? I'm helping mommy. Okay, good for you. Good for you. Chat, is there anywhere to heal in Mizaho, or am I just out of luck? Maybe the well heals you with, like, magical healing water? No? Like, look at look at my health and my, my TP right now, man. I just want a small smack roll of healing. Don't think so? That is, uh, that is highly unfortunate. I have plenty of apple gels. Let's do that. And then... I don't have many orange gels. Let's just use that one on rain. All right, let's get going. To Ozette, at last. I'm pretty sure Sword Dancer is supposed to be around here somewhere. He might actually be here in the forest. I don't remember where, though. Hey, magical light beam, in case we need it. Oh, never mind. This just goes right to field again anyway. Now we're over here. What's this way? Oh, I don't have the Noish Rock for this section. That makes a lot of sense, actually. Is the Noish Rock around this corner? It'd be pretty pog if it was. We must be merciless. I'm always merciless. I don't believe in mercy. Ow, that was a lot of damage. Maybe I should believe a wee bit in mercy. Are you okay? Maybe I should put Perseia in. We'll, we'll like be super down on healers. In place of rain, we could run the full Tethiala crew. Okay, let me let me let me see here. We gotta figure out a fusion move between Zelos and Sheena. I really want to see if Zelos and Sheena can combo Thunderblade. So we want to use Thunderblade with Zelos, and then we want to use all of these different seals with Sheena. Let's put Spirit Seal here instead because we haven't tried it yet. I'm pretty sure. There's no way that it combos with Corin. That would be weird. So we're just gonna have Zelos use Thunderblade every time, and have Sheena use different uh, what you calls it. And then we can just leave Regal on all of that. That's fine. So, for Sheena, I want to use her default one right now. Here we go. Thunderblade! Crescent Moon. Fusion? No fusion skills. All right. Spirit Seal does not work. You know what? 
So to make this simpler on myself, let's immediately, instead of remembering to hit a different button next time, next we try, we're just gonna go up the list, next we try Life Seal. We try Life Seal next time and see if that gets the combo. And if it doesn't, then we switch Sheena's default move to a different one. And we just, we rinse and repeat until we go through all of Sheena's moves. It's possible that she just can't combo with Thunderblade. But then we just start doing it again, but we use like Air Thrust. And so we basically rinse and repeat until we find something that, uh, I can't get to that noise rock over there. Oh, I've already gotten to that noise rock, actually. This counts as the same area as that side of the thing. Which is gonna make me get off of noise here in a second. Yeah, okay, that's really interesting. That's funny. So we need to go this way. We're gonna end up fighting some enemies because, yep, because the running ones I won't be able to avoid without Not noise. Which is fine. Oh my goodness, calm down, Regal. Dude's comboing for days. We can we can build back up the super bar and keep trying to find a combo with, with Sheena and Zelos. Yo, two lemon gels. That's really useful.